making her debut at UFC 216 in what is developing into one of the more exciting divisions in the UFC, Poliana Batelho is coming in as a strong 125-pound women's flyweight. Her career is shaped by competing in multiple promotions, FKMMA, JTAF, Batetti Combat, XFC, and now the UFC. She brings with her an impressive 51 record with all five of her victories coming on her own terms, via knockout or referee stopped page. She is a fight finisher, and she doesn't have a history of leaving it in the judges' hands. Devastating strikes Poliana is an excellent striker, one of the better strikers in the 125-pound women's flyweight division. She picks her spots and unloads in a fluid, controlled motion. She moves with a purpose and is always looking to be in an advantageous position. One thing about Poliana is she won't make a lot of mistakes. She has a great ability to make fighters miss while creating distance and then regaining that distance. Movement is an often overlooked skill in one that can be a difference maker. A lot of people put too much stock into a fighter's reach, but what good is it if you can't take advantage of it meaning you can be the hardest hitter, have the most feared fists and always have a reach advantage, but if you don't know how to use it for your favor, what good does it do? Being a knockout artist, she naturally has a lot of power, but it's the speed and creativity of her strikes that set her apart. Delivering spinning back kicks on target more often than not, and switching stances can cause a huge problem for an opponent. Again, none of this matters if a fighter can't use these tools to their advantage, but Poliana doesn't have that problem. Owning the cage is key, and something every judge will look for. Scoring points by damage is one thing, walking into the cage with the mindset that you are going to control every aspect of the fight is another, and one Poliana does well. That is what allows fighters to finish fights, that is what allows knockouts. It isn't sitting around waiting for that submission or waiting for your opponent to make a mistake and then swing at the head with all your might. Smart fighters own the real estate in the cage and they force their opponents to get uncomfortable and make mistakes. Poliana has been working on her ground game now more than ever and is currently expanding her tool set with Brazilian jiu-jitsu training. Taking her art form seriously and devoting everything she has to it, this girl is serious and will have a shot at making a legit run at the title, but that all begins with UFC 216 and a tough opponent in Pearl Gonzalez. Pearl is hungry, coming off of a disappointing UFC debut at UFC 210, where she was submitted in the third round via Rearnik choke. Gonzalez boasts an impressive 62 record, and we can be sure that both of these women will bring the heat in this fight. This is a good striker versus grappler contest, but Poliana won't hesitate to do whatever is necessary to win. Who else is excited about Poliana's UFC debut? It's been a long time coming, and Chess earned it. Share your thoughts in the comments. Want to share your opinion? Why not write for us? Previous post, previous, next post, next.